Happy Valentine's Day! It's February, Saturday, 14th, 2015. And I am your host, <laughs> Ed Colt, or as many of you know me as, Radar. So, how is everybody today? Um, I'm doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. You know, not much else going on here. Uh, packing is done. Done, done. Just, you know, like I said before, the, uh, the, <laughs> God, the electronics, the electronics, uh, need to be packed up. Um, going to have to do a bit of, uh, bug bombing here before I move those, though, because we have issues with, with little critters, and I don't want to, <sighs> I don't want to have to, uh, worry about that. <laughs> Um, loved Ken to death. I mean, I loved him, and but he was a little bit of a hoarder. So keeping the house clean wasn't really an easy task. I I, I got it mostly done, mostly done. Uh, once the cats are out, uh, I can I can take care of that. And it's probably going to be another week, uh, maybe. Uh, yeah, I want to say another week. There's only a couple, uh, only a couple more weeks left in this month. <clears throat> anyway, uh, I just came in from outside, and you can tell I didn't even switch out my uh, glasses. I decided to just go out, take a drive. Uh, I needed to. I needed to clear my head, I guess, and get some fresh air. And, you know, I can use the van up until the end of the month. That's when the, when the tags expire. And it's, you know, I, I pretty much told uh, family, his mom, that the van can, you know, stay with them. You know, they can do whatever they want with the van. It's not really going to be a big deal where I'm moving to because of the it's it's on a, a metro metro line uh, capital metro that's the Austin bus line and uh, probably be able to use Joseph's car if I absolutely positively need to I'm going to try and avoid that but there will be days where I'm not going to feel like riding the bus or maybe I can just get a uh, a shift that matches his that or comes close to matching his that way we can ride in together whatever uh watched uh watched a movie last night finally got to see mr peabody and sherman <laughs> they added it to netflix yay uh, i've been wanting to i've been wanting to get it on dvd and uh video or blu-ray blu-ray it's it's a cute little movie it really was cat is in my closet again trying to climb my bookshelf. Uh-huh. Sally? <sighs> Sally May? She's giving me that look. Get over here. Get over here. Here she comes. There she is. Can't see her from my mic, but she's being a butthead. I don't want her clawing my new coat. Joseph gave me a leather, uh, a nice leather uh, jacket. It's really, really cool. But I don't want Little Miss <clears throat> her. Say hello to the audience. I don't want her messing up my clothes, <laughs> clawing at them. She's being a butthead. But no, I, I ended up watching uh, watching that last night and a few episodes of MASH. Um, I was supposed to get a phone call last night. Uh, been trying to get a hold of a friend of mine for the last three days, and she has yet to return my phone call. So I don't know if she's avoiding me or what. I don't know irritate me a little bit because she's 
that she was gonna help me out. And I had a nerve tremor. And it's a bit annoying, and my patience is like this. I mean, it's not bad, but, you know, it would be nice if she called and said, hey, I can't make it. Instead, I don't know. I don't know if she just forgets or is avoiding me right now. Sally's being a butthead. Aren't you, Sally? Um, what else? What else? Uh, coffee. Um, video's kind of late today. Overslept. I didn't get up till like 9.30, almost 10. I'm not gonna do anything. I'm not gonna do a damn thing. Why bother today? You know, people said they're gonna come over, or whatever. It's just like well, since last, uh, since last week. Since last week, nobody's, uh, with the exception of Lindsay. No one's called. No one's come over. No one's come over to check up on me. And you know, I guess I wouldn't find that too bad, but you know, I like company too. <laughs> you know, I want to take a break from this place and it's going to be another week maybe while I'm here. Am I going to have another week of, you know, nobody, you know, visiting me, whatever? pain in the ass. Excuse my language. It really is. Maybe I want a little company. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm kind of in a gripey mood. I'm still working on my first cup of coffee. Cat? God, you act like you get no attention. Jesus. Sorry. Sorry. Um... She gets tons of attention. Don't let her fool you. She's just being overly, overly needy right now. All right. Okay. Nothing else going on today. Uh, still waiting to hear if we're going to be going to uh, um, Sherwood Forest Festival or Fair. Sher Sherwood Forest Fair yet to hear about that but we'll see hopefully we'll get to go up I would like to go up there and see uh, my friend Nikki uh, and uh, visit with a few people out there so <laughs> other than people not calling me and not coming by I'm just thankful that uh, I have my online friends Joseph. You know, at least they, they've been keeping me company and my Facebook family. It's just, it, it, it's a little disappointing, you know, when people say that they're going to call or, you know, whatever, and they don't. You know, it's been three days. <laughs> you know, I thought I was going to get a little help. It didn't happen. So it's all up to me again, as usual. It's happened before in the past, but we're not going to get into that. You know, when they want something, you know, and I help them out, you know, I kind of want that in return, you know. Kind of, not expect it, but isn't it kind of, kind of, uh, kind of common courtesy? Sally, it's being a pain. It really is. Messing with my window blinds. You've already torn up two of them between you and your sisters. Anyway, I guess I'm going to go for now because I really don't have a lot to say. I'm sorry if I kind of rambled on and been kind of gripey today. 
but I'm going to take off. So y'all have a great day. Uh, if you don't have a sweetheart, don't worry about it. You know, <laughs> you know, why don't you make time for yourself? You know, be your own Valentine. I've had to do it before. You know, even, you know, when Dan isn't around, it, it just, it gets kind of lonely. But, you know, if you have a sweetheart, you make the most of today. Um, actually, make the most of every day with your sweetheart, your partner, your lover, your husband, your wife, whatever. Just make the most of it. All you need is love. Till next time, y'all. Peace.